Hey guys, and welcome back to Let's Play The Thousand Year Door. Man, now that I've just kind of sat here in between episodes, I never realized this place is actually a little bit relaxing. You know, there's sort of a bubbly sound effect going on. We've got what looks like water going up the tree. Kind of uh, somber music here too, so cool. All right, let's get going. I'm not gonna bother checking all these things. I'm sure there's something in one or two of them, but I don't, I don't care enough. All right, so we're going up, and we've got another one of these stupid yuxes here. Yeah, it kind of sucks that I had to cut off in the middle of that battle, but, uh, you know, I just really ran out of time there, so whatever. Uh, yeah, let's take out the x Nod. He's got a Fire Flower, so no, we definitely want to deal with that first. Whoa, holy crap. <laughs> Something fell down and hit the crowd there. All right, so uh, I think these things, they don't have too much HP. It's either like three or four, but uh, we can take them out pretty quickly here. And of course, yeah, see, this is where they start to get a little bit annoying. Uh, when you have like more than one of them, then uh, they'll oftentimes like, it it'll, it'll ha turn out to where one of them will get like two or three of those stupid little guardian things. So, you know, and you kind of just have to deal with it. All right, we also got the effects of that little spell that we had put on us. Uh, it, it takes a little bit longer than it was in the first one, as you can probably see, but uh, it helps out sometimes. There we go, we finally hit one of these in a battle that I'm showing, jeez. So basically what happens, uh, like I've already said, you get the... Uh, uh, we we haven't hit that before, have we? I, I don't know, I, I think we have once, but for some reason I just can't remember. But yeah, I see the, the mushroom there refilled your health. And uh, it also brings the maximum amount of people into the audience there, so we're now at max out at 50. We were at like 30 something before, so. And then whenever this happens, the guy gets like two of those stupid guardians. Uh, you gotta take out both of them in one turn, then let them attack again. And then I mean, so yeah, these guys can get really annoying, especially if there's more than one of them. Uh, we should be able to take them out on this. Actually, no, we won't be able to take them out on this turn. Ah. All right, this battle took a lot longer than I was uh, expecting. I, I wasn't really <laughs> thinking it was going to take this long, or else I would have just went ahead and cut it out. But All right, yeah, do your little thing. All right, and then one more attack will take it out. Well, at least we got to show that little uh, roulette wheel thing, if we haven't before. All right, finally takes care of them. We get some decent experience out of them, though. I mean, nine star points is pretty good for three enemies, so I guess I'm not going to complain about that, huh? All right, and now let's keep on heading up. Ah, we got a little scene here. Man, this is brutal. How much longer till we find that stupid crystal star? Not even those puny punies we captured know anything about it, and they live here. After all this pointless searching, I'm thinking we're looking in the wrong place. Huh? Whoa. <laughs> um, ouch? Hmm, alright, what was going on there, huh? Hey, look! Some sort of old shriveled puny. Elder! Punio, is that you? You're looking well. Why are you so calm, Elder? You're trapped, and this is our daring rescue of you. Oh, a rescuing, is it? Well, thanks, I suppose. These are quite exciting. But I think you ought to help the other punies before you rescue me. Where are the others? Big brother? Hmm, let me think. Where was I? Ah, oh, yes, right. Your question. Uh, <laughs> wow, holy crap, that's a lot of punies. Katuni, thank heavens! You're here, you're safe! I knew you'd come for me, puny I just knew it! Of course I would, dear sister, and I brought us a mighty ally. Look at him! We're gonna get you out of there right away, I swear. You just hold tight a second. Okay. Mario, listen, we gotta find the Selkie and we're going nowhere. Well, we can go wherever we want. I think they're going nowhere. Uh, what's interesting is you can actually come in here and sort of uh, <laughs> mingle around with these guys. Yep, alright. So let's uh, get out of here. We're looking for two Selkies, one with the Elder and one with all of these guys. So let's just keep going to the left. Hey, look, it's this room again. Ah, yeah, there she is. Oh, well, isn't this a treat? We must stop meeting like this, don't you think? Hey, stop it right there, Missy. You're that thieving girl we saw before. What are you doing here? Well, anyway, I heard there were nice badges to be found here, so I came looking. Only problem is, I've been running into more trouble than I expected. Ah, do you have to do that again? Hmm, <laughs> but who cares about that? Lovely to see you again. 
Ew, not another smooch. Who do you think you are, you total floozy? <laughs> awesome. The precious crystal star you're looking for is near the bottom of this tree. Good luck finding it before the others. Take care of my handsome stash superstar. Let's get together again soon. I can't believe that girl. Oh, I can't stand her. Yeah, you tell her, Gumbella. Oh, he's awake. Ugh, oh, my aching. Hey, you! You're the dirtbag who hit me from behind, aren't you? No, it wasn't me. Yeah, real fair, you scum. You fight dirty, you get dirty, and I'll be doing the dirtying. <laughs> Alright. So we're in another battle with an X-Knot here. They give a vent music like this is some big battle, so that, I guess that's why I'm leaving this in, but one attack is gonna take care of this guy, so. You know, yeah, huge battle there, right? I mean. Alright, so we take care of him. And he drops a red key that opens the red cell door. Alright, what else is around here? Nothing in there. What's in this chest? Oh, holy crap! An Ultra Shroom replenishes 50 HP. Nice! Alright, we're definitely keeping that. Let's get rid of the stupid end coupon. And, uh, avoid it on the way out. Right, what's this? Oh, we can't investigate this? That's stupid. I wonder what that is. It looks like a map sort of thing, doesn't it? I don't know what all the rest of that stuff is. I'm not even about to guess, but... Alright, so I'm guessing the red key is gonna open the, uh, red cell door here. Elder, we're back. We're here to rescue you. Foolish child! Whoa, holy crap. Punio, sit down this instant and keep your mouth shut. Huh? What? Why? What did I do? Uh, listen, Elder, I don't know why you're mad, but we came here to help you. Stop your mumbling, you, and mind your elders, you whelp. How could you abandon your poor sister and run off like that? Absolutely shameful. But, but Elder, I just went to find help to help rescue you. Oh, stop with the whining. You never interrupt an Elder mid-lecture. Never. You wonder why the other punies call you a doofus sometimes? That's why. And your time to be a doofus is over because you've led our puny tribe what you have to lead our puny tribe one day. Uh, a day is not far off, and that is why you need to listen. Now, first of all... Several hours later. Holy crap, man. Or else, you got that? From now on, you've got to get your act together, Punio. And of course, we've fallen asleep. Yes, Elder, yes, I understand. Bah, only answer once. But say, by the way, why are you here, anyway? Uh, I was just telling you, we came to rescue everyone. We started with you, Elder. Oh, is that so? Well, good. In that case, get me out of here already. Criminy! The cell is cold, which isn't good for the old back, and there's this damp stench. Yeah, alright, get out of here. Uh, well, there she goes. Enough standing around. Yeah, we still haven't found the blue key yet. Okay, big brother, I'll be waiting. Alright, good. Well, let's go back. Now, maybe now that we've saved the Elder, that big, fat puny will listen to us. Yeah, we can kind of take a shortcut down here and just sort of, like, fall off and go down the pipe. So that's pretty cool. There's a lot of rooms like that in this place, actually, where they have, like, multiple levels in the same place. And you can sort of fall off to get to the lower one, but... Alright, shouldn't be too much further. Yep, there it is. Alright, fat puny. Well, if it isn't Punio. Hmm, you heard me. Hmm, can't say I'm expected to manage to rescue the Elder. Told you I could do it. Don't get a swelled head. This doesn't mean I'll accept you as our leader. And it definitely doesn't mean I completely trust that mustache guy either. Oh, come on, man. What more do I have to do? For starters, you still haven't rescued the other punies yet. I'm not lifting an antenna to help until you do. You stubborn mule! Deplorable. How dare you talk like that, knowing what we're up against. We must stand together now. We must take back our tree. Don't you understand that? But, but Elder... Shut your trap, Puniper. And mind me, you hear? You'll help Mustachio here. What'd you say your name was again? It was, uh, it was Marty, wasn't it? Uh, it's Mario. He's Mario. I mean, sheesh, he's only world famous. Come on. Yes, yes, summer down, you. And everyone else, help Mario clear out our tree. Now, first it's Murphy, and now it's Mario, huh? Oh, all right, Elder, whatever you say. I'm not heartless or anything. To tell you the truth, I'm worried about Petunia, too. Yeah, I'm sure you are, buddy. And you're right, we have no choice. We must fight, right, everybody? There you go, my punies. That's the spirit. All right, so ten punies joined your party. Nice. Thanks, you guys. Hey, if you're done rallying everyone, I have a question. You're looking for this crystal star thingamajig. Ever heard of it? Yeah, saying crystal star thingamajig is really going to help them remember it. Crystal star, eh? Hmm, yes, perhaps. Hidden down, down, down at the bottom of this tree is a funny colored stone. But what do we do with it? 
All right, guard it from evil and give it to a pure heart. That's what generations of elders have been taught. It might be the crystal star. Marty, or Martio. I'm thinking you better get it before those goons do. I don't quite see how just yet, but I bet it's connected to us getting our tree back. You got all that, Martio? Crystal star, bottom part of the tree. Go to it. All right, sounds like a plan. Are you not done talking yet, old, old bag? Oh, hold your horses. I forgot something. Before you can get to the crystal star, you must save some all the captured punies. Yep, you'll never get to that gem without the help of all of the punies. Not a chance. So here, you better take this. It's the puny orb. It's the symbol of our leader. Whoa, cool. All right. If you place this in the pedestal you see around the tree, the punies will gather. Ah, so that's what that slot was for, huh? Just remember to take the orb out when you're done with it. Uh, because, well, if you don't, everyone will just kind of hang out and stare at the orb. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. It's kind of funny. But okay, so we got the puny orb. And uh, let's go rescue everybody. We're going to take care of that in the next part. So until then, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.